Hi, I'm Brandon with another Reclaimer update. New York State has been hard on business for many years, but small businesses might have it worse than anyone as they try to build an enterprise that can provide a future for them and grow the economy. They're being crushed by countless taxes and regulations that make this task extremely difficult. There may be a chance for relief, however, brewing in Albany, which is important given the large percentage of job growth driven by small business. Here's what you need to know. For starters, small businesses have to tangle with New York's 49th ranked business environment. It's the toughest place to make it aside from New Jersey, so you know the situation is bad. Secondly, despite corporate tax reform passed a few years ago, we still have the 49th ranked income tax rate. We still have the 32nd ranked unemployment insurance tax in the country. And we still have the fifth highest average property tax burden out of all 50 states. That all means more expensive products and that it's harder for a small business to make it. Lastly, officials always seem to be cooking up plans to make these problems worse. State lawmakers are trying to mandate workplace retirement savings programs now. This is something that 86% of businesses opposed in a recent survey. How about New York City, where Mayor Bill de Blasio proposed rules that would prevent employers from making scheduling changes, like asking someone to work a shift because another employee got sick? Now, how much sense does that make? Forcing small companies to carry this burden and expecting them to spark the economy is like making a chef cook with one hand tied behind his back. It's asking for a tasteless, terrible meal. So why does government think it's okay to sabotage small businesses with outrageous taxes? It's setting them up for failure and it has to stop. Legislation being considered in the state capitol would offer some relief from these tax burdens, but it will take New Yorkers like you to make sure that things don't get worse for small business. Thank you for watching, sharing, and staying informed because it's up to all of us to reclaim New York.